tug of war, more than just a game. Hello, dear learners. Today, we're going to explore the phrase, tug of war. This is an interesting expression that has its roots in a physical game, but can also describe certain situations in daily life. Let's dive right in. Tug of war is originally a game where two teams pull on opposite ends of a rope, trying to bring the other team across a middle line or marker. The team that manages to pull the other past this line wins the game. This game requires strength, teamwork, and strategy. Imagine two groups of people, each trying to pull a rope in their direction. The team that pulls harder and more effectively can overpower the other team. Beyond the literal game, tug of war is often used in English to describe situations where two forces or opinions are in conflict and are pulling in opposite directions. For example, a tug of war between two companies trying to dominate the market. A child caught in a tug of war between two parents during a divorce. The term captures the essence of a struggle where neither side is easily giving in, and both are putting up a fight. To help you understand better, let's look at some example sentences. 1. The court case was a tug of war between the defendant and the prosecutor. 2. There's always a tug of war in fashion between classic styles and new trends. 3. The two siblings had a tug of war over who got to use the computer. These examples show how versatile the phrase is, and how it can be used in various contexts to describe a conflict or a struggle. So, there you have it. Tug of war can refer to a fun, physical game or a conflict between two opposing sides. It's a powerful phrase that perfectly captures the essence of a struggle or competition. We hope this explanation helps you understand and use the phrase more confidently in your conversations. Until next time, happy learning!